Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. Somebody sent me this and they want to make the font the color of the background. I don't really know what this background is. It's a bitmap of some sort of blend of green and reds. But I noticed that the fonts are not grouped together. You could do this individually, but select both fonts and control G to group them together. That makes it one item. And then select all the fonts, the font and the background. So we've got two objects selected and go right here to intersect. And when we do that, it intersects those colors. Uh, to me, they don't really stand out that much. Um, I would try, um, I don't know what, you know, I don't know if the colors are representing Christmas, but we're gonna make this red and then get the interactive fill tool and swipe up and then make the top one a, a green. So you have a little bit more definition of colors. Um, and you could play around with this quite a bit. You know, you could put another red here, another green, you know, here, kind of get them. Well, that looks not too good. Uh, let's just back up and leave it the way it was without the extras. And, you know, you can play with your slide bar and take the, the red and actually even angle them over a little bit, you know, get a different look. And let's get that about level. And then let's take his font and put it about right there, maybe. So, and if you notice that the, I, I made the object later, so it's on top. So I don't really think it, it, yeah, it does matter in this case, go up to object order back up or front of page and then select everything. We've got the two objects selected and then go to intersect again. And I think you get a little bit better coloration by making your own, um, still not, you know, to me, not perfectly, um, you know, I mean, it is green and red and kind of, uh, but it, that kind of looks brown uh, because it's the blend. And, you know, so what's so nice about this, your font's still there. So you could still get your interactive fill tool and maybe add a lighter green up top. And you know what, that might look pretty good. Let's try to, let's try to split the red up, put another green here. I'm just trying to give him some idea. And then we are going to um, put another red like right there. And with this right here, I would go to smooth it out. And it gives us a little bit different look. And then select, and this is just some suggestions. Go up here to intersect. And to me, it looks a little more festive. Anyway, I hope that helped him a little bit. Thank you for watching.